So here it is, the Big Jack's Burger in all its glory, a burger as robust, as unique, as intense, I would even say, as the guy it's named after, Jackson Powers Johnson. Thank you for being here, first and foremost, and thank you for coming up with this creation. So to kind of kick things off, can you just explain to me everything that is on this thing? So we got great bun. Yeah. Under it, we got queso. Okay. Now queso, big queso guy. Yeah. A little bit of queso layering on that. We got mac and cheese. Uh, we got some pulled pork on there with some really great barbecue sauce on it. Two patties, bacon, and then bun. Awesome, so it seems like there's a specific way we eat this. Some people like to just go straight for the burger. You know, we don't have fries around here just because it's so much. So I like to eat the excess okay. mac and cheese and then get into the burger. Awesome, let's get into this. This is amazing. So glad I haven't eaten. Ever since it kind of went viral over uh, the NFL and on CBS and all that. Uh, there's a lot of been people coming in and ordering it. So it's been a, it's been a great job. So yeah, how happy were you to spread the word of the Big Jack's Burger? In it was awesome. I was really I was really uh, surprised that someone asked me about it. Just because when you're at the combine, they like it like they hit hard in interview. They really, yeah. Yeah, and uh, they just asked me about the burger, so I just kind of ran with it. What's the weirdest question you got at the combine? I think it was came from a scout. And it was, um, would you change your uh, foot size or not? <laughs> and I said yes, because I, I have size 15 feet and I can't find shoes my size. I know Ruma Dunze got asked if he would uh, be able to like land a plane, like safely. I would, I would, I could land a plane. Okay. I really think I could. I really think I could. What makes you say that? I'm good under pressure. But number one, you have the people on your walking you through it, uh, I think. <laughs> and I feel like I've watched Sully, I've watched. Flight's a good one where it all goes wrong and he figures it out. Yeah, uh, the movie Airplane. Yes. Back in the day. I think it's very realistic. Yeah, very realistic. I think it's very, very realistic. I think I could do it. I really think I could do it. I love the confidence. Okay. All right, let's get into the burger now. Yeah. I'm ready for the review of this. So, so you can just, just get into this. Just go in, now, there's no other bacon. way. Look at that bacon. It I is juicy. Go. Wow. Wow. So two patties cook perfectly. That's really good. I feel like even if I wasn't sitting right next to you and you weren't the scariest offensive lineman in the nation, <laughs> yeah. I would still give this a 10 out of 10. It's a great burger. This is incredible. For those of us mortals that will never get a burger named after us, mm -hmm. how good does that feel? What does that mean to you to look on a menu and see something that says your name on it? I'm just going to dive in during this answer. So, um, Quarterbacks get to throw their touchdowns. Receivers get to catch them and running backs get to run them in. Let me get burgers named after them. And uh, I think it's just, I think it's a tribute to all the linemen that came before me and they're gonna come after me. This was this is for you. Because linemen deserve a little bit of love. So it's awesome to see on the menu. And uh, it's just cool to see people order it. So it's a great job. As I talk with my mouth full, Thank you so much for your time, Jackson. Uh -huh. This was amazing. Boom. I got barbecue all over my face. It's a good time, man.